All right then, gang, so we've seen now how to make a card and a badge component with these Tailwind classes, but they do use a lot of classes. And if we wanted to make multiple cards or multiple badges, we'd have to use all of these classes on each one we created. Now imagine as well, if we wanted to change the style of a card, then we'd have to change it in every place that we have a card. And the same would be true for badges. So that's not a great idea. And it's also looking a bit messy as well. So instead, it would be nice if we could extract these different classes into an external selector using some nifty Tailwind syntax, and we can do. So what I'm going to do is open up my CSS file over here in the source folder, and I'm going to create a selector for card. So anything with the class of card. Now, if I want to use all of the same classes for this selector that we have defined in our HTML for a card, right here we can do that using a directive called apply like so now the apply directive is a little bit like a mixing in sas and we can nest it in a custom selector to apply other classes to it so all we need to do is grab all of these classes right here and cut them from here and paste them after apply over here now anything with a class of card is going to look at that and it's going to apply all of these classes to it so all I need to do now is give this a class of card and we have a reusable component which we only have to update over here and not in every place we create a card now. That's a bit better and it's also much tidier too. It becomes much more reusable. So let's do the same thing for the badge. Let's make another selector called badge and then in here we need apply and then we grab all of the different classes we use which is all of this stuff right here cut those and paste them over here and then we can save this and come back over here and give this a class of badge instead now because we changed this file over here the source styles we have to run the build command again to rebuild the css so let's do that at the bottom we say npm run build hyphen css that builds it for us now if we preview we should hopefully see no difference because it's still applying all of the same classes it's just that we've extracted those into styles.css instead so they're not over here so let's preview and we do see exactly the same even if we refresh so that has worked okay so now we have that let's add a few more cards i'm going to grab this thing over here and i'm going to paste it down here two times and I'm going to change this from stew to noodles because we have a noodles.jpg image over here change this to noodles as well and let's change this to veg noodles and then down here I'm going to change this to curry this to curry and then finally this to tofu curry all right save that and preview and now we can see three of these cards. Cool, so that is much better. Now we no longer have all of the classes defined right here inside the HTML. When we have a lot of classes that we're using over and over in different places, in that case, it makes sense to extract all of those into a custom selector and we can apply them using the apply directive.